Now to a new warning about face masks. Feds have seized millions since the start of the pandemic, but counterfeit N95 masks are still being sold to hospitals and medical providers, sending states scrambling to find and recall them. Becky Worley has the story. Good morning, Becky. George, good morning. U.S. Customs and Border Patrol saying they've seized more than 16 million counterfeit face masks from last year through January 31st of this year. And that's just the fakes they've found. A new alert warning that potentially millions of counterfeit N95 masks have entered the hospital supply chain. And for medical personnel, that could be a matter of life and death. Hundreds of thousands of N95 masks, meant for some Washington state medical personnel, now being pulled off the shelves. It's incredibly frustrating, demoralizing, dis disheartening. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security sending an alert that fraudulent N95 masks have been found mixed into the supply chain across the country. The Washington State Hospital Association sending major N95 manufacturer 3M photographs and lot numbers of masks bought from a distributor being told they bought fakes. They look... They feel, they breathe, they fit like a 3M mask. In 2020, Homeland Security investigation showing GMA some confiscated counterfeits like these. And the differences? If you look closely at the writing on the mask, it says 3N as in Nancy. The quality of the inside of the mask is not as good as the authorized respirator mask. Officials not saying if the counterfeits are less protective, but 3M fighting back, telling ABC News it recently helped the state of Minnesota avoid buying 500,000 fake respirators from a Florida company that had no relationship to 3M, adding it sued and won an injunction against that company. Meanwhile, the state of Washington backfilling the lost masks. 3M expediting more than a million respirators to them as they continue the fight to keep their medical professionals healthy as they care for those with COVID. 40 to 50 hospitals in Washington state turning up these counterfeits. And George, we do not know the extent of their distribution nationally. So Becky, what should people be thinking about if they want to wear upgraded masks? Well, N95s, the one in this story that were counterfeited, are still being earmarked for medical professionals only. You may see legitimate KN95s like this or KF94s like this for sale online. There are lots of variations and brands of these, but experts tell us if you see 3M branded N95s for sale online, be very wary and very skeptical. Okay, Becky, thanks. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.